All right, you guys, we just got to our room and y'all, I cannot contain the smile right now. You guys ready? <laughs> Good morning, you guys. It's another early day. We are actually leaving LA right now. It's been a lot going on, but we don't want to bore you guys with the same old, you know, we had some meetings and then we're gonna go eat and, you know, we don't want to do all that. But actually, we're going somewhere very exciting and we're not going home. So come along on this travel day with us, you guys. Let's see what we get up to and comment down below. What do you think you guys ordered? <laughs> Can't talk. Comment, Comment down, down below. below. Where do you guys think we're going right now? Where do you think we're going right now? Comment down below. Hey, hey, sir. Which, which, which terminal are you going to, sir? Um, why are you filming me? Um, it's a free world. You guys, we actually made it to security without tree getting searched. Yes. The first time in a long time. The first time in a long time. <laughs> Let's go. I feel like you're following me. Are you? Get on my vlog. If we're sitting beside each other again, that'll just be weird. Just keep your hands and feet to yourself. <laughs> and my foot room is for you me, not for you. have a Good. short ride to a hotel where we can relax and eat and then Who we'll said, tell you guys where we are. Nah, we're not relaxing. Yes, no, Trey doesn't like to relax, clearly. We're not relaxing. We're not relaxing, apparently, no. so we're gonna do... Get that out of your head. I right? love have... to relax a little bit, and um, everyone does. Okay, so we're here for a couple days. I might let you relax for one third of one day. That's such but a lie. Today. Before we even plan this, you said, you know what, I'm actually down to relax this trip. I I'm, I'm actually gonna relax. We relaxed on the flight here. We slept, we relaxed. Now it's time to turn off, let's go. <laughs> All right, you guys, we just got to our room and Y'all, I cannot contain the smile right now. My husband always tries to surprise me because I cannot be surprised, or at least I thought I couldn't be, but clearly I can be. And let me just show you guys what the room's looking like right now. Are you guys ready? <laughs> Clearly, I'm gonna be having an amazing day for the rest of the for the rest of this trip. Like this is just so beautiful, and honestly, it's the little things that just make me feel appreciated and loved. So thank you so much, You're baby. Welcome. The smile on your face makes it so worth it. I, I love it when you're smiling and you're happy. It, sound, it sounds door, cliche like, and corny, but what the heck? Yeah. Like it's not even Valentine's Day yet. I love it. <laughs> um. So yeah, you're welcome. Thank babe. you, babe. Also, as if the day couldn't get any better for you, we just got confirmation. The number one seafood restaurant, all right? And it's gonna be live music. Yeah. So if y'all don't know, Keisha loves seafood, all right? I so do. they said the seafood restaurant is like, that's the spot. So we got reservations tonight. Yes. Live music. Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah, happy you happy. That's I'm it. I'm so yeah. happy. As you can see, I have a permanent smile right now. But I just feel like this trip and like just us, like we were saying in a few vlogs ago, that like just doing more of like this and more of us is like definitely the change that we need right now. And I'm loving every minute of it so far. So yeah. Yeah, so I let's change it. and I stuff like that. Come and on, did you show them the view? No, I let's... should show them the view. And then you guys can really probably tell where we are. It's so bright outside. Oh, our room is like really indoor, outdoor, it which is, is so cool. This, this, yo, this whole is thing, right it's like our balcony out here. We can take a nap out here. But this view, oh my goodness. Right. Absolutely beautiful. And on that side with the mountains back there. Whew, gorgeous. Yo, that's where we stayed last time. We were over there. On that side? Uh-huh. 
Are you I sure it wasn't drive, further that way? No, I used to drive over here to, to go for my morning runs. Yeah. I used to run in front of this hotel. So so we came to the same place. We're in Cabo, by the way. We're in Cabo. Or some <laughs> Aww, people say, you some, people, it. <laughs> some people say Las Cabos, uh, Mexico. Los, Los Cabos. Um, we call it Cabo. But anyways, so we came here for Keisha's birthday. And I used to go from our villa. We, we were in a villa that time. Mm -hmm. I would get picked up in the morning and dropped off over here to run. And I would run in front of this hotel yes. every day. And now here we are, years later. <laughs> yeah. No matter what, Cabo looks good on you, babe. Aww. It looks good on us. <laughs> looks good on us, you guys. Yeah, we're just gonna chill, I guess. Reservations aren't until uh -uh. eight. Like I said, we're not eight. chilling. Are we we're gonna not go relaxing. walk on the beach, get some lunch. Yes, we're gonna go we out. To eat. Yeah. yeah let's go. <laughs> Y'all, the aesthetics of this place is so beautiful. Yo, it's just a big vibe already. And we just got here, big vibe. Most importantly though, y'all, we are getting some food because I literally <laughs> have not eaten today. All I had was some French toast on the plane. And right now, what time is it, babe? 2.13. It's 2.13. Normally by this time, guys, I'd be on like my third or fourth meal, okay? I've only had one meal and I got to admit, they always calls me out for it and I'll admit it's true. I do tend to get a little hangry, all right? A and little? I'm, yeah. Don't even try to <laughs> sugarcoat this right so now. How would you say? You'd say a lot? You get hangry to the point that like, I don't know if we're about to break up or what. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I'll admit it, y'all. If I'm hungry, you like really hungry, you probably don't want to be around me. So we about to solve that right now. But I'm not, I'm not there yet, but I'm getting there. Every corner we turn, it's just so beautiful. Like, look at this walkway now, babe. Y'all, you know what I'm seeing everywhere we turn? What? Picture opportunities for you, babe. Yes. I'm gonna be your personal photographer. Yes, I'm gonna go beat my face after lunch. Uh -huh. We're gonna scope out the spots, and then yeah. the whole time we're here, I need to get reels and. Uh huh. Like I said, I'm your photographer. Yes, thank you. For but that I will collect payment at the end of this trip. But don't worry, I'm not talking about cash. We're gonna figure something out. Okay, there's an agreement we need to make. Yeah. <laughs> so we're about to walk through here to have our lunch. Big vibes, y'all. Late lunch. And but a lit lunch. Late but late. Late but lit lunch. Yeah. Food looks really good. Let me show you guys what we got. We got some, did you say yellowtail? Yeah. Ceviche. I got a shrimp cob salad. Got some dressings. Got some corn tor tor tortillas. Tor corn chips. Corn chips. Corn chips. Corn chips yeah. <laughs> Cheese wrapped beef tacos. Asada. Asada. Asada taco. Guac and a little bit more dips and some more chips. Mm, muy excelente. Excelente. Mm, yeah. Yeah, more um, excellent. How do you say bon appetit? Like, enjoy. Um, yeah. Yeah. All right, T-Squad. So this right here, it may look like water, but it's not, all right? This is my favorite drink in the world, and it just so happens to be a Mexican drink, and we're in Mexico. This is Mezcal, all right? Similar to tequila, but not tequila. All my Mezcal drinkers, let me know in the comments. But I'm trying to get my wife right here, Mrs. Rushton. I'm trying to get her to get on this Mezcal, all right? She hates it, but it's something I love so much. So it's like, in, in a relationship, we supposed to like, I do the things that you love, you do the things that I love. So, so this is something I love. tonight? What kind of mushrooms? Real mushrooms, like not the crazy wacky <laughs> yeah. ones, like ones that you can have sauteed on the Yes, side I'll have some mushrooms tonight, but I want you to sip the mezcal. So I need you to smell it, take a little sip, move it around your mouth, and like get the aromas and feel it. And okay, so the first step is to smell it. Smell it. Yep. Shake it a little bit. Mm -hmm. Smell it again. Mm -hmm. Now take a baby sip and like move the the liquid around your mouth. I got a little like, bit of food in my mouth though. You good, is don't gonna, worry. Is it gonna taste like guac or is it gonna taste like mezcal? Hopefully it tastes <laughs> like mezcal. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Still don't like it. Still don't but like it? okay, oh, I tried man. it, I tried it. <laughs> you guys, I've been trying for a long time. I'm talking about since 2020. Since that's 2020, that's when I got on the mezcal wave. Yes. Before that, I was strictly a tequila guy, and I guess my wife is keeping track. In 2020, I became a mezcal guy. I still love my tequila, but mezcal, different level. Babe, can you please learn to love it though? Um, you know, I love a lot of other things. Just, just like how you don't really like mushrooms and whatever else. It's just one of those things, like. I eat almost anything. I eat raw fish, I eat sushi, I eat crab. Like, 
whatever I'm not allergic to, I pretty much have that. So it's only that. You're not allergic mezcal. to mezcal. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, y'all, lunch is busting. After lunch, though, I'm trying to get on that beach, man. Are you trying to get on that beach with me? I'll get on the beach for you. Y'all, I, I know it's like, we're just eating lunch, right? But no, things are happening right now. Y'all seen that Keish hated my mezcal. She's trying to give me this bite, right? This bite of her salad. Why does she drop corn in my mezcal? Like Unintentionally, <laughs> I thought you were gonna open your mouth, but you're like, whoa. <laughs> and then this is the biggest the bite piece of salad. Of corn I'm, I'm not a salad person, but I'll take it. Whoa. It, it's a mouthful, ew, sir. <laughs> Why are you giving me so much? Because with the Cobb salad, you gotta try to get a bite of everything before you... I said I'm gonna get it out. Where's your knife? My knife has food on it. Yeah. Eat, lick it off. You're gonna drink this anyway. This Pause. is so ghetto right now. <laughs> so it's ghetto. okay, you're ghetto. <laughs> Maybe just a little bit. <laughs> hey y'all, so tradition, whenever we touch a beach on vacation, we gotta go put our feet in the agua. Usually it's just you, but I'm here this time. Yeah, so let's go, come on. After you. All right. Woo! That water cold, I mean it's warm. It's not cold, it's warm, come. Come on, babe. <laughs> I can't lie, the water is cold, but it's still beautiful. Definitely way too cold to swim though. Come on. Get over here. You can at least put your feet in the water. Okay. Mama, you from Toronto. There. You from Toronto, come I'm on. I'm from Toronto, but I got Caribbean blood. You blood. from Toronto, stop this. I put got all my aunties and uncles. Come. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, why is she acting like this? Come put your feet in the water. Uncles know what it is. Babe, come put your feet in the water. You know what I always ask my family? Come put your feet why in the water. Why did you guys move to Canada? You guys came from the island. Why couldn't we be in Miami or? We are in Miami, babe. We live in Miami. This Come put your Miami. feet in the water. Well, we live in Miami. This is a warmer element. Put your feet in the water. Maybe tomorrow when the sun is up. Bro, yeah. you actually not gonna do it? Put your feet in the water. The water is beautiful, wow. Y'all, I never knew my wife was this soft. Soft? Soft, y'all, soft. All right, T-Squad, it is several, several hours later. We did not intend to sleep, all right? We literally came back after the beach and we thought we were just gonna lay down for a few minutes. We ended up waking up like 20 minutes before our dinner reservation. Yeah. We literally had to just wake up, throw some clothes on, and we cannot miss this dinner, y'all. But as you can tell from our faces, we just woke up. I didn't up. get time to do what I said. I was gonna, <sighs> go. I was gonna get cute, put on some makeup, all that stuff. And... You're still cute though. Thank you, but you know, like I had plans. Like, wh <laughs> why are we going sleeping for so long? We slept for like, what, three hours? Yeah. We slept for three hours just out of nowhere. Like we just, we woke up to room service. Luckily they were banging on the door and it woke us up just in time for our dinner. So yeah. we head in there right now. At least we didn't miss the dinner that we we're looking forward to. So let's get it. All right guys, we got appetizers going on. I got a pecan soup. Don't look that good, but trust me, it's going to be good. We got some toasted brioche bread, asparagus and scallops. Your appetizer looks like a meal, babe. I was about to say that, you know? Yeah. Well, I hope it's bomb because I'm ready to eat. Right? On top of that, y'all, we got the heat lamp because for us Miamians, it is cold. Yeah. It is kind of cold right now. Friend that we're very cold. Maybe we should get our iron checked. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's because we live in Miami, babe. I know. Also, y'all, if y'all hear that beautiful music, we got a live band. Check it out. We got a live band for dinner right now. Big vibes or what? Big vibes, I'm enjoying every minute. And main course is about to come, let's go. All right, y'all, the food is here. They didn't even have Wagyu on the menu, but I made a special request and it's just our luck, y'all. Everything is going our way today. I got my Wagyu, I'm super happy. I'm about to be cooking it myself on this hot plate. We got some sides, we got some potatoes, broccoli. Babe got catch of the day. How is it? Very good, very yeah. fresh. And as you can tell, they brought us blankets, all right? So you see Babe got on a blanket and another heat lamp. We got a heat lamp here and a heat lamp here. The They're fact like, that they had it, our point. Yeah. Has heat lamps on, so we're not tripping, guys. Right? But they're like, oh, y'all live in Miami? All right, let's get you guys warm. <laughs> All right, T-Squad. So we had an amazing dinner last night, and I need y'all to take one last look at this amazing setup because after this video, it will be gone. All right? So it is the next morning. Um, I want it to be gone. You want it to stay? I want it to stay forever. 
All right. I mean, it's really up to you. It could stay. Because <laughs> we're going to the spa right now, y'all. We need some much needed massages and relaxation time. And I thought that they were going to be cleaning our room and taking this while we're gone. But if you want it, it could stay, babe. It's up to you. I mean, the rose petals can go, but this can stay. All right. So the balloons are going to stay. That's the, that's the, what she wants. That's what it's going to be. The rose petals will go. This will stay. Also, y'all, I'm upset because we were supposed to get pedicures and massages, and I cannot get a pedicure because yesterday, the day before our spa date, I wore some sandals that I forgot hurt my feet, and now I got cuts on my feet, bro. You guys, look, man. This side and this side. The day before we go, and I've been waiting for this pedicure. Look how bad I need it. Like, I'm not even too too prideful to show y'all. I need the pedicure right now. Babe, what is my luck? The day before the pedicure, I get cuts on my feet? Yeah, you have bad luck right now. <sighs> so we just gonna get some massages. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's all right. It's all right. All right, y'all. So make sure y'all go subscribe to join the family because if you're with the squad, you ain't popping. Let us know in the comments. Do you want to see another Cabo vlog before we go home to Miami? Let me know. All right, peace out. <laughs>